welcome back to 243 Outdoors. Today I got the Inner Arms 243 back out. I've uh, torqued all the action screws, the scope screws, checked everything over on it, and we're going to give it another try today. Uh, start out just shooting about five rounds, seeing how it does, and then I've loaded up some of my own hand loads. We'll try that out. So let's get started. These are 65 grain VMAX I'm going to start out with. Those two stacked on top of each other. Bad all right this seems to be a lot better that is a five shot group measuring roughly two inches so uh, we're gonna shoot some 105 grains I just hand loaded a little bit ago they should be really precise so we'll give them a try all right these are 105 grain the boat tail hollow point match Hornady bullets uh, 42 grain the reloader 19 just loaded these a little bit ago Not like those. Go back to these 65s. Tell you what, this ain't a fast enough twist to stabilize those. That's my trouble right there. Try some 75 grain VMAX. May just go out to 200 yards to see what it does. Just kind of a high hold. All right, that right there will go an inch and a half group, so uh, very happy with that. Uh, I shot three with the 105 grains, and I only hit the steel once. But the uh, more I think about it, the, the twist is not fast enough on that gun to stabilize those 105s, so uh, that's my trouble there. I never even thought about that, but uh, we'll walk out to 200 yards and see how it looks. All right, we're out here at 200 yards, shot five shots, and that's about a six inch group. Um, I think the gun's definitely liking the lighter bullets, so uh, we'll send a few more here. All right, I scratched about three X's in that target to aim at, so uh, let's shoot some more of these 75s at 100 yards, see how they do. Good 
definitely tightened up again. Shots about an inch and a half group, probably a two inch total. So, so I got just a few left of these 75s. Didn't finish them off. We have about a 10 mile an hour crosswind today. About two inch group, except for that one that dropped down. Um, basically, loosening and then torquing those action screws tighten this gun up a lot. Um, I used my fat wrench and I uh, made sure the uh, scope caps were torqued down to about 20 inch pounds, and then I think I torqued these at about 40 inch pounds. And uh, really, that's all I've done. And it seems to like the 65 grain the best. Uh, it opens up a little bit with the 75 grains. Uh, I would say this is a uh, pretty slow twist rate on this gun. I don't know what it would be. Uh, my heavy barrel Savage is a, like a one and nine and a quarter and it shoots the 105s really good. And uh, I can tell right now, it, I only hit the target one time at 100 yards with these uh, 105s. So uh, it's uh, definitely not a fast enough twist for it. So uh, I'd say this gun's probably got a lot of age. Uh, barrel life is probably getting close to the end, I would think. Uh, I'd say it's still got quite a few rounds left in it though for uh, a two inch gun at 100 yards. It's not bad. Uh, be a good truck gun. Something to play around with anyway. But uh, thank you everybody for watching and we will catch you later.